I want to share with you one way of completing this vocabulary assignment. First, type in any one of the two links that I provided for you for a file called Techno Jeopardy and download that to your computer. You will get some uh, spam at Mediafire. Here is the Techno Jeopardy file as it looks as downloaded from Mediafire. You can also download this file from my server, which is peakwriting.com, where I keep a lot of our course materials. So simply put in that URL, and you will be able to download that from my site. We'll open up the uh, game, and this is what it looks like. Okay, the first thing you'll want to do is to change the title. This original template was about audio waves, so we're going to change it to something appropriate for our exercise. Techno Jeopardy. Then you'll want to change the names of each of the five categories to coincide with the vocabulary that you're taking from the book. Again, these categories can be however creative, whatever terms that you wish to put in there. Let's click first on 21st Century for 10. Here's the slide. And so what you'll need to do is to change the two elements of the slide, the question and the answer. You simply click in the text box and replace the text that is there with your text. And the same thing for the answer. Notice that whenever I click in that, it coincides with that custom animation on the right. That one under It Needs a Medium coincides with the one over on the custom animation pane. And you want to make sure that stays the case throughout your show. So I put in the answer, AR for Augmented Reality. We can also change the picture, select it, delete. Since this is for educational use only, you're welcome to use Google Images. Go to Google, click on Images, type in your subject term, and select an image that, for you, captures the essence of the question about augmented reality. To save any image from the internet, right-click and then select Save Image As. I highly recommend that you create a folder for all of your work on each of your projects. We'll call this one Jeopardy Images. Open up the folder and then save the image. To insert the image, you click on the PowerPoint slide, go to Insert, Picture, From File, browse to your computer to that folder you just created. Click on the image and then click on Insert. And then position the image to complement your slide. Now to test the show, we simply activate the show, and you can do that in a number of ways. I'm going to click on the projector viewer at the bottom. So we've activated the show. I click on 21st Century for 10. Whenever I'm ready to reveal the question or the answer, you left click on the slide, and the answer slides in.